I would just say the openness and being very welcome, you know, like immediately when I walked in and like for my first day here, here I was immediately greeted. I've got the chance to meet all the players, the staff, the people who mm -hmm. I've been working with. With it's been truly a welcoming experience. It's full of a bunch of great people who really try are trying to make this program the best it can really be. So. Uh, some of us knew each other uh, before the season started, uh, but after the season and kind of throughout the season, um, we've gotten to know each other a lot better. A lot of us uh, have actually become friends just outside of the facility. We hang out, we go grab food all the time, we'll go play basketball. Um, and then even some of us are thinking about living with each other next year. Oh, I love the eSports training facility. I use it like three times a week, all day. I, I will do my homework in there, I'll do Zoom meetings sometimes in there. And then I'll, I'll obviously play video games in there because that's what it's mainly meant for. But it's also a great place to go and listen to people and hear different ideas about life and other interests besides gaming, as well as just hearing people talk about what their special interests are. I think it says a lot about like the, the progressiveness of the, uni and the, of the university and their commitment to understanding like the changing uh, views of what pe of pe of people enjoy. Because right, right now, esports compared to 10 year, years ago is nothing like it is to, to then. And this is like represented in the varsity pro pro program. So mm -hmm. I think it's a great thing that, uh, that, the, uni that the university is doing.